Hello! Now, I'm going to share with you how to get from Hiroshima Station to Niigata Station for the Tobishima Kaido Cycling Tour. My name is Jordan, and I'm living in Japan. I'm making this video with you to share with you my favorite bicycle route in Japan. Now, I'm going to share this trip idea with you through a Japanese traditional way of storytelling called Kami Shibai. Alright, let's get started. Hajimari, Hajimari! Of course, Hiroshima is famous for the atomic bomb building and also Miyajima Island. But, I want to introduce to you a more of a local experience where you can really enjoy moving your body and experience the heart of Japan. This place is called the Tobishima Kaido, and it's a string of seven quaint islands connected by seven very picturesque bridges, and it's super, super beautiful. It's in the middle of the Seto Inland Sea, and it's surrounded with some amazing views. While you stay in Hiroshima, if you search for the Setouchi Cycling on the internet, you will come across this page. Of course, this page is in English for your easy navigation. While looking at this page, you can see the beautiful ocean with floating islands scattered all over the place. Just imagine yourself going there and being on a bicycle adventure in rural Japan. The Tobishima Kaido is a world-class bicycle route that takes you across seven bridges and passes through seven different islands. The scenery here cannot be described in words. It's unbelievable. Try out some of the delicious Japanese food that uses local produce and fish while interacting with the friendly people. Choose one of the seven different types of bicycles for your adventure. Make a reservation here at the homepage. All right, let's make a plan for your trip. Let's check out the access from Hiroshima Station by the local train. We need to check out how much money it costs from Hiroshima Station to Niigata Station. This is where we'll get our bike. Now, Niigata Station is in Kure City. Don't get confused with Niigata Prefecture. That's on the opposite side of Japan. Niigata Station is not far from Hiroshima and only has one train transfer. Today, let's take the 7.30 a.m. train, which will get us arriving right before 9 a.m. All right, let's get started. Be careful not to sleep in. Let's leave the guest house and go towards Hiroshima Station. Okay, first of all, let's go buy a train ticket. All right, so now we're gonna go buy a ticket. In Japan, it may look very confusing to buy a ticket, but it's actually really easy. Just look up at the sign for your destination and it tells you how much money it is. There is also an English menu on the purchase screen. Be sure to bring cash with you because Japan has a very cash-based society. All right, let's go head to the Kure line. Now, depending on your departure time, here we go. The platform number that you'll be riding depends on which time you'll be departing, so make sure to check your platform number. And if you did not eat breakfast yet, Feel free to try the standing soba and udon restaurant right past the ticketing gate. If you never tried this, it's a very interesting experience. Japanese noodles are said to be very healthy. There is also free Wi-Fi at Hiroshima Station. So check that out before you head out. All right, we are now starting our train ride to Niigata Station. The Seto Inland Sea is known for the calm ocean and many, many floating islands. Riding on the Kure line towards Niigata Station, you can see the beautiful ocean view outside your right window. There's a triangle-shaped island called Minoshima, and also an island called Etajima, which is famous for their fresh oysters. If you get a chance, I recommend checking that out too. Some little reminders about riding the train in Japan. Be sure not to eat, talk on the phone, or be too loud to disturb others around you. Also, please let the older people and children sit down if they need to. And watch your heads for the hand holders to not bunk your head into it because they're a little bit low. Don't be hypnotized by the beautiful view of the sea. There is one train change that you need to make. This train's final stop is at Hiro Station. Here at Hiro Station, you will want to transfer from the first platform to the third platform. To do this, walk up these steps, cross over, and go down the steps to the third platform. There is not much time to transfer, so make sure to hurry up. 
If you ride the train from Hiroshima Station at 6.30 a.m., you do not need to transfer and can ride all the way to Niigata Station. Okay, we have arrived at Niigata Station. There will be a small little truck waiting for you at Niigata Station. And look, here is your bicycle. The staff here will hand you a map, give you a briefing of the tour, and you can also make your payment here. The bicycle return spots are at Okumura Port and Niigata Station, so make sure to confirm which spot you will be returning your bike. Now, I am at Niigata Station. Check it out! Look at this service. I got my bicycle all ready for me. All right, let's get my helmet on. All right, thank you. Let's go check out the Tobishima Kaido. Thank you very much. Goodbye. See ya.